Hi, my name is Natalie Hummel. I'm an extension entomologist and associate professor at the LSU Ag Center in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. My primary responsibility is to work with the rice crop to develop integrated pest management recommendations. And today, our discussion is going to focus on rice stink bug scouting and management and why you should be concerned about this when you're producing a rice crop. The rice stink bugs move into the field at heading and they're most attracted to the crop at the flowering stage when they will move in and they can actually start to cause injury in the crop at that stage. What we're going to do in this portion of the video is demonstrate how to appropriately scout the field. We do recommend taking 10 consecutive sweeps with 180 degree on the angle as demonstrated um, here. We're going to demonstrate this in the field in just a second here. Take 10 sweeps in 10 different locations in the field, making sure that you sample both the outside and the inside of the field because there are times when you might have a population that's congregated more on the edge of the field and not so significant in the inside. So we do encourage you to move into the field and, and take some actual samples and then put out treatments only when they exceed the published thresholds. We're not going to talk about the thresholds so much today because they do change with time based on research results and also the variety and the yield potential of your crop. So contact your local extension service for those guidelines on thresholds for treatment. What we're going to do now is one of my graduate students, Bryce Blackman, is going to demonstrate how to properly take some sweep samples in the field. You can see that it's a bit of a laborious process uh, walking through a flooded field taking these samples so we do realize it's a challenging thing to do. But it's important that you do take the sweeps in the appropriate manner. Uh, when you're done taking sweeps you would then look inside of your net and count the number of rice stink bugs. After you take the sweep you would quickly open it up and count the number of rice stink bug adults and immatures that you find within the net. Current LSU Ag Center recommendations focus on counting the number of adults but nymphs can also cause injury. Those are the immature stage of the stink bug. So you can see here that we have some of them got away. We had approximately 15 stink bugs in this sweep. And so you would take that into account, reference whatever the current thresholds are, and then make a decision about whether or not you should put out an insecticide treatment.